Morning guys. Um, I just woke up to this. Freaking cows. What the heck? Well, that's something new. Guess it's time to get up, huh? It's a freaking beautiful day. The sun is shining. It feels like the first day of summer again or something. It's amazing out here. So I'm gonna go ahead and make some breakfast. My plan for today, I'm gonna go into Lassen Volcanic National Park. Um, the hike to the top of the mountain actually, so the peak is at about a little over 10,000 feet. Um, and the trailhead to get to the peak starts um, like 8,000 feet. So it's about 2,000 feet up and uh, about five miles round trip. That's not bad at all, it's totally doable. I can do that. And then I'm gonna head down to uh, Lake Tahoe. It's about a little over three hours away. I'm gonna have to go into Nevada. Look at this freaking swarm of yellow jackets just everywhere. I've made it to my 10th national park on the trip. Number 10, Lassen Volcanic National Park. We are about three hours uh, northwest of Lake Tahoe. And this place is beautiful. I'm sitting at about 6,000 feet elevation right now. I'm gonna go and head into the Loomis Museum, which is their visitor center, and uh, just check out what it's all about, I guess. So this is an old seismograph. Well, so the eruption uh, of Lassen took place June 14th, 1915. They actually got some really good photos because they anticipated it happening with machines like this. Well, now begins my hike up to that peak. That is Lassen Peak. It's at about 10,000 something or another. And we're at about 8,500 right now. So let's give her a go. Oh, we're getting there. It's a windy one. I stopped at a lesser windy spot, but stopped here to take a break. Looked down at a rock and I saw this just sitting there. It's about my size. This is perfect. So I'm actually going to wear this. It all works out and rewarding views already. Oh man, what a beautiful day. Oh, and the peak is right there for me. Well, now begins my hike back down. A little technical right here. Gotta watch your step, but really past the snow. It's, it's a pretty easy hike. Man, the lakes out here in Lassen Volcanic National Park are freaking beautiful. I wish I had more time here in Lassen National Park. It's really a pretty place. I stopped at Emerald Lake for a little bit. I uh, washed my socks. My socks are just drying here. Soaking up the sun. I'm still about two and a half miles away from Lake Tahoe. I stopped in a little town called Quincy. Beautiful, beautiful drive so far. Tons of national forest land and I don't know, it's just so freaking beautiful. Uh, anyways, I got couple groceries before I go into Yosemite since I'll be in there for a while and I also got some chicken for supper mm. well guys I got to my campsite uh, pretty late found a place right outside of Lake Tahoe thanks to that iOverlander app is really hard to find a good good place it's not parking right on the side of you know the main highway uh, my plan is tomorrow I'm going to go into Nevada, get some cheap gas because gas is about two gallons, two dollars a gallon cheaper in Nevada, just a few miles away. And I learned that thanks to that Gas Buddy app. Wow, apps are just saving the world. Anyways, I'm laying here watching uh, Star Wars. After the gas tomorrow, I'm going to be heading into Yosemite. Oh my goodness. So another long day of driving. I, I did a lot of driving today and really sick of driving but one more long day of driving tomorrow and then Yosemite is the heart of this trip it's really a major major reason why I planned this trip and the route that I did I'm really looking forward to it my expectations 
I'm trying not to let them get too high, but from what I hear and what I see, man, Yosemite is going to be amazing. That's pretty much it, yeah. So thanks for watching today's video, guys. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get at least 100 subscribers. Uh, that way I can customize my URL and make my channel more searchable, um, more easy to share as well. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Yosemite day tomorrow! We'll see. I'll probably camp right outside of Yosemite, actually, tomorrow.